Oh, thank you, G-Man. Well, listen, on the topic of health, this next recipe is a lactose-free dish, and it is packed full of flavor. Made with love by Clover. We'll make the most of the legumes, the grains, and of course, pulses sitting pretty in your storage jars and turn them into delectable, delicious salads like our caramelized zucchini and lentil salad that's gonna to be topped with a clover nolak creamy dressing. We have Dr. Micheli in studio today to show us exactly how to make this delicious dish because food is something you are super passionate about as Great. well. Yes. Well, food is health. I mean, I think that's my mantra. Yeah. Um, and the salad kind of personifies that, you know, there's so many healthy things in front of me that I just feel good already. And, 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 and a salad does not have to be boring. A salad does not have to be lettuce, tomato, no. cucumber. No, not at all. You know, and there's a lot of hidden things in salad sometimes, but you can still keep it healthy and keep it extremely exciting. So with this salad, there's a nice hot component. We have little zucchini rounds that we cut. Got a little pan on the heat here. We're going to saute them off. You can actually eat them raw, but when they're caramelized, they're just so much better. Oh, definitely. So a little bit of olive oil, any oil that you're using, and into the pan that's going in there. You want to use a pan that's big enough to fit like a nice flat layer of zucchini. That way you get a nice caramelization mm. of all of them. And it's evenly caramelized, some pieces. Absolutely. There's nothing worse when some people... Some, some of them are raw, <laughs> some of them are cooked. You never want that. Okay, don't, want to, don't do what I'm doing. Use a, use a spatula. <laughs> okay, cool. And then into the bowl, we're just going to mix everything together. While I'm doing that, I'm going to ask you to mix the, the dressing. I think that's the highlight of the dish. You know, oh. This is not really going to be the same. Okay. Um, so so you have that, the dairy snack, and it's about a cup of that. Okay, so I'm adding our NOLAC. I was trying to be all fancy, but yeah, let's do it pour this it in way. There. So one cup of our clover NOLAC, and this is, of course, lactose-free, plain, low-fat dairy snack. And it is, of course, if you are lactose intolerant, symptoms which include, you know, perhaps an upset stomach, some stomach cramps, bloating, nausea after consuming dairy, that possibly means you could be lactose intolerant. And with the Clover No Lack Lactose Free range of milk and dairy snack, it really enables you to enjoy dairy again in versatile and delicious ways, like making this delicious creamy salad. So I've got about a cup of our No Lack in here. Cool. And then you're gonna add, so the ingredients or the flavor profiles for that is gonna be like a tablespoon of chopped uh, coriander, a little bit of dill, and then we always add an acidity lemon juice, and then dried oregano gives a really nice earthiness and it goes really nice with the lentils. Oh. While you're mixing that up, I'm just gonna show what's happening on this side. Um, so we have about a cup of cooked lentils. You can take them out of a tin, you can buy them raw and just cook them off in some water. Um, that goes into the bowl. And then celery. So a lot of people also don't know, you can actually use the stalks of celery. Ah. It's a nice hearty, like sort of leafy green and it goes really nice with a, with a creamy dressing. See, I'm quite terrible. I yeah. get rid of that. I a lot of people just... throw it away. <laughs> you can actually cook it off as well, a little bit, saute it down. It makes like a nice wilted green. So that goes in. Um, and then we have olives. We've just pitted them and halved them. Obviously, you always put them before you put them in a salad. And then pomegranates. These are, these are mm. beautiful. They add a, such a nice textural component. So that goes in the bowl. And then these zucchinis are not entirely ready yet, but it is television, so you know. They usually take about five to 10 minutes, slowly in a pan. While they're sauteing, I always season in the pan. So you get a little bit of seasoning into that. I'm just gonna add them to the salad for the sake of, of time. Usually they're a little bit brown, a little bit more caramelized. We add them to our salad, and it's also that quite nice there. that there is a hot component, but this is a salad you can eat freshly made, like you've Absolutely. just done, or cold, you can serve it cold. Cool, and you mix that up, you always season. A little bit of seasoning into the salad. So you season the cooking zucchinis, you season the salad as well. And then in with flaked almonds. Oh. Like nice slivered almonds. They're such a nice textural component. Really good healthy fats. Um, really just bringing the dish into a nice new spectrum. And Mix then we will finish it off with our no lac yeah. dairy snack dressing that we've made. Well, if you want to get your hands on this delicious recipe that Michele is showing us how to make, please visit our website. That's expressoshow.com. Search for the zucchini and lentil salad. And if you're going to be making it yourself, do share some pictures. We always love seeing you recreate these delicious recipes.
Made with love by Clover.